But first tonight, parents and students are testing a new security measure at Guilford County Schools. Good evening, I'm Chad Silber. There are now weapons scanners in two GCS high schools. The district is considering them for all high schools to spot weapons before they get inside. WFM 1 News 2's Grace Holland found out how families are feeling about the new technology. Before the school bell rings, a scanner beeps. It could be the future for Guilford County, a daily check for weapons. This is actually where we can hit, where we can hit quick response. GCS could become the seventh school district nationwide to install these body scanners, checking students and visitors as they come in the building. The community trying it for themselves as part of a pilot program at Smith and High Point Central. I'm sure it will use the minds of a lot of parents. Mary Harris came to Smith High School with her family in mind. I have a couple of nieces that are coming to school this year to the high school and I don't want them to be afraid. They're already talking about being afraid. Do you have some glasses case by any chance? Kim Stroud doesn't have kids in the district, but as a Smith alum, she wanted to try it out. I'm a traveler, so it's like going to the airport. You know, it's the same scenario. Here's how it works. A steady green light means no weapons detected. No one has to stop. Say a student is walking in carrying a backpack or something in their hand. The machine might go off as they're walking in. You see that red light that comes on because of it. Teachers and administrators will be watching this screen as students are coming in. The red box tells them what item the machine is worried about and they'll be able to decide from there whether that item needs to be searched. <laughs> School leaders also got a closer look. So did Greensboro police officer Renee Singer. She supervises the city's school resource officers. Plus, her child is a GCS high school student. As a parent and as a police officer, anything that can be done that is a deterrent for somebody that has um, bad intentions is, is a plus. The district will look at feedback from parent surveys before voting to permanently install scanners at all traditional high schools. In Greensboro, Grace Holland, WFMY News 2.